Hello and welcome to this setup tutorial for the game Cloud Age. If you'd also like to know how to play this game, I have a separate video for that. I'll be setting it up in the way it should be done for your first play. Here's how you get it ready. Take out board number 1, number 2 and number 3. You can already place boards 2 and 3 with the A side up. Just look at the board. And board number 1 is placed based on how many players there are. If you are with up to 3 people, place it with the A side up. If you are playing with 4 players, place it with the B side up. Another board. This one. You can place that next to the main board. And this last one can go on the other side. Also place it with the A side up. Next, some pieces. There's water. That's these ones. And metal. Those look like this. Now let's get some cards on the table. This first deck looks like this. Just shuffle it and place it anywhere around the board face down. The other one is a bit more complicated. Take out this deck and three of these sleeves. Shuffle the deck and then make three stacks of eight cards face down. Like this. Eight cards on this one, this one, and this one. The rest of these cards can go back in the box. Now put each of these decks into sleeves without looking. And when it's in, you can place it face up on one of these spaces in this board. Do the same for the other two. Time to get out everything for the players. Pick a color. I'll be purple, so I take this player board with the purple airship on it. Then I have to put in all the puzzle pieces. You have to place them with the side up that shows these red numbers, not the other side. There are three for the left side of your player board. You can put them in any order. It doesn't really matter. And there are four pieces for the top side of your player board. They also go with the red numbers up. Every player also gets to take two water and two metal. You also have pieces in your own color. I have purple, so I take all my purple pieces. I've got this one that goes on space 1 on the purple track of this board. I have this big drone that can go here. With this one, I keep track of my points. That goes on 0. I have this token in case I score more than 50 points during the game. You can place yours here. My own airship token. That goes here at the left side of the main board. For my own player board I have this energy marker. For every player that goes on space 2 of this track. And finally I have these little purple cubes. If you are playing with up to three players, you use seven of these cubes. 
if you are with four players, you use six of these cubes. The ones you don't use can go back in the box. Then place the cubes from right to left on these spaces on your board. You also get your own cards, these ones. Mine have these purple numbers. Shuffle them and then place them on the left side of your player board. Every player also gets to take five cards from this deck. Keep them face down in your own area, but you can look at them. Almost done! You have these cards that say Scenario and these cards that say Chapter. If you want to play a basic game, use the card that says Scenario 1. If you'd like this to be the first game to be the start of a nice story, use the card that says Chapter 11. Whichever card you chose, place it somewhere next to the board. Now it's time to pick a first player. For now, that'll be me. I get this first player token. If you chose to play with the Chapter card, the first player reads the story from the card. And now you're ready for round one. If you want to know how to play this, follow me to the tutorial. Thank you for watching this setup. Feel free to leave a comment and see you for the next one.